25 were wrong. In Hamilton, the family dollar is related to some questionable business practices, systematically jacking up prices at checkout, according to the Butler County Auditor. That's unreal. That's it's unbelievable. When you think of things like that, it's hard to believe, but it, I don't put it past anybody, you know. 13 Butler County Family Dollar stores were tested. All 13 failed price verification checks. This comes a week after auditors tested 20 Dollar General stores and all 20 failed. At least one Dollar General store had a sign telling customers the register price was final. Folks are going to these stores looking for maybe a little bit of a bargain and they're potentially getting ripped off at the, at the register. Roger Reynolds is a Butler County auditor. His office gathered the information on both chains. Every one of them had issues. How unusual is that? That's the worst I've seen. Uh, I haven't seen anything close to that in the 14 years that I've been county auditor. At the Dixie Highway Family Dollar, 25 items were checked. 21 prices were wrong. 20 of them in the store's favor. That's an 84% fail rate. Anything over 2% is considered unacceptable. The best family dollar store tested had a 12% fail rate. Customers we talked to don't think the wrong prices are a mistake at all. I would say it's intentional, but not by the direct employees, not by the hourly employees. It's more upper management. They know what they're doing. Auditors are telling people to watch the prices and make sure they ring up right because for now they found some serious dysfunction at the family dollar. Yeah, so even after these stores were all notified, I went into this store, uh, bought four items. One of them was wrong. Family dollar has not returned our phone calls. Reporting live, Brian Hemrick, WLWT News 5.